Okay, my bad. Uh, real life called a little bit. Where was I? Anyway. Um, scrap. So let's see. I wanted to do something very specific. I don't really remember what it was. Uh, oh yeah, I can talk to Jenny's and deliver his commission. And now that we had our deal with Poppy, we can talk to her for commissions as well, which I should do. This is also on a timer. I should do this. Have we dealt with the annoyance? Yeah, we did. Senior position at Glover and Glover. With the younger Glover gone, I might rise even higher. Good stuff. Devotion. Ambition. So let's put some passion here as well. Let's see. Let's put it on fast forward. Whoop. We got an iron spintria, some erudition, some mystique, which might happen with this issue over here. And let's talk to Poppy. I am, Poppy says with a girlish giggle, curious about, oh, you know, the arts of blood and ice. It's silly, but allow an old woman her whims will you help me. Uh, Poppy gives us commissions on winter and... I don't remember which one blood is. I think it's it's either hard or grail. Let's see. Oh, the study of victory of the crows. Crowns, actually. By Arum. Arum's scholarship is dubious, but he, she, writes Ifly. Incidents of sudden and violent deaths are interspersed with amorphisms. Hours don't dream, long try not to. This is knowledge that I have from playing the game before, but I, it's a good idea to share this with you. Hours is how the game defines the upper tier of God. Long is a lesser entity in the manses oh yeah we have knife secret okay so we have we got a lesser edge lore which is fine here's what she needs oh knock oh so she is winter and knock okay Yeah, I can't do anything about that. Mm. Can I study anything? I don't think I can. I should I know I can't go to Morlands. What am I doing here? Seek out secret passages, okay, so I'm investigating the city with this uh, occult scraps. Um, oh, we have tentative evidence, that's bad. We also have restlessness. We need to find a way to deal with this contentment. With, with this drag, we need to find some contentment. Congregation of St. Felix of Shroom, a non conformist St. Cloud of Etero Etero-dox sect of a Calvinist offshoot tucked away in an odd corner of the city. Uh, they bellow hymns of, with unsuitable gusto, in a throat scrapping language that is very much not quite Latin. Uh, oh, yeah, I should put the professional muscle here, goddammit. Yeah, I can't do the commission for Poppy and Janice is still on cooldown. Uh, where is Clovat? Go search someone for me. Hire me an underling. 
Let's dream of the white door. And something to study, anything. Do I have anything? I want to see if I can take care of these recipes with painting. I don't know if I have time for it, but... What is your cooldown? Okay, it will be okay. We got three funds, which is nice. So let's paint with passion. And use the restlessness as a yearning. Our stay on us is still a tree. Uh, I need... I want to make this table as unorganized as I can. But there is a limit to my understanding of the structure of things. So let me just... I'm going to at least try to centralize the lore a little bit. It doesn't need to be like super organized or anything, but just like... So that these things are like more or less in the same thing. This can be stay right here because I'm just going to use this to explore, but... Um, yeah, that should be it. And I'm gonna leave Poppy with her commission over here. Put Glover and Glover very close to the thing. No, Clovac. Find me something I can use. Oh. So this is edge 3. I have edge 5 on this person. If I can combine those two, I might be able to clear one of these, assuming they actually need edge. If they don't need edge, then that's a whole other problem. I am inclined to agree with this. Let's see. Let's let's just try it. The problem now is determining which one of these is the. Oof. That is so loud in my headphone. Jesus Christ. Um. I have no idea. Sage of Night. I don't. Wow. That's a. That's good. Entering the white door. Last night, I visited the lodge of the Sage Knights. My hostess manifested as an elegant woman with fashionably short hair and dark glasses. No, she admits, I don't need them anymore. Any more than I need eyes. Allow me, allow me my sentimentalities. But you have come for knowledge, I expect. Here is a story I heard in my Karishan days. You are welcome to it. Only remember me if you come to make the pilgrimage. Hmm. I have an idea who this lady may be. I don't know if it's correct or not, but well. And we got another Forgotten Chronicle, which is nice because this one, maybe we can actually explore with it instead of break it down. Or we can break it down once for two of these. Let's do that. That seems like a, a more productive idea. We got passion, we got some glimmerings, and we got two funds. Huh. What a thing. Uh, go back to work. Devotion is reason, right? Yeah, reason. And ambition. I need to be very careful. This needs to say ambition. If it says anything else, do not put a passion in there. Let's see, we have this as well. Oh, the timer is really running out. Um, put it back. A hapless corpse will generate another notoriety, which is pretty bad. Um, should I dream of the white door again? Um, I have health. Yeah. Don't know if this is a good idea. Okay, we have a hunking fellow. We have Claudette, thank you for your service. I have to wait for this to finish. Maybe I can explore while doing that. No, let's just go to Morelands, I think. 
No, even better. Let's go to War Flames. Let's see. Let's pay very close attention to this. This is Sanskrit Dictionary. A lucid book which outlines careful path for the thickest and vast of complex language. Yeah, uh, we don't need this. I have Sanskrit Scholar right here. Oh, and I finally managed to clear the dread from there, probably because of the contentment that comes from not being in a relationship. <laughs> uh, anyway. Yes, that's nice. So we have two furtive truths. And I will use to explore later, so that we can get some higher level expeditions. Okay. So we have Professional Muscle and a Hulking Fellow. Both of them are Edge. And Rose and Victor are also Edge. So if I unite everyone together, we can have a completely successful expedition, like 100%. As long as I can identify exactly where Edge is actually needed, which can be a challenge. Oh, God damn it! So currently Scratch. This is not always obvious. We prepare for the sense. We bring rope to light. We arm ourselves against anything down there that may yet move. I am. Um, this sounds like forge. Like I am not super convinced that edge would be useful there. What about this one? The one who came here before us had marked the door in the hillside. Door. This is knock. And here it may yet yeah, be, but it's still, yeah, this is luck. Uh, so yeah, none of these is super useful right now. So explore another code scrap and lock this person down. And maybe I can just, I can do one of the other ones. I'm pretty sure this is knock. And this as well, maybe not this. Let's see, if I can just find something else, I would rather try something else. Work at Glover and Glover. When I close my eyes, figures march behind my eyelids. When I open them, the light hurts. We got three funds. Go back to work immediately. Use a reason for it. And also use a passion. It says ambition, right? Ambition, okay. So loud. How do I want another fortress truth? Sure, why not? Mm. Yeah, I've read this before. Eh, whatever. Many of the dead enter the menses through the white door. They wander its corridors in silence until they are lost. Some embrace each other, some devour each other, some force their way into the dreams of the living. A few record their memories in the menses stone where it is soft. They scratch it with their nails, you see. Last night I read one of those memories. Yeah, I definitely read that one before. Mm. Dream of the other. Let me let me check a thing. So much like in the same way that we use the wood with some piece of lore. So this says a sense. It will it will accept desire. Oh. Mm. Or health. It won't accept lore. It will literally just accept the ascent, the as desire. Okay. The ascent is slow. Wind from nowhere pluck at me. My skin is stained with light, the wood shivers with motion far below. Okay. Let us see then. Hmm. Uh, got some fascination, we can fight that. Let's see, let's see. Our reason is back. 
forgotten betrayal. No, hidden door. Just like very clearly, this is this is knock. Shit. I need to to take a guess here and use something. These aren't like all knock. That's impossible. So I'm reading something wrong. I'm gonna try this one. And let's pray that it works. Only one fun, because I, I have no idea what's down here. So memberships of membership of the congregation, it's strictly controlled. It may even be inherited. The safest approach is to burgle the minister's residence while he is conducting a service, but the sworn mother of the congregation guard the the place in shifts and they are not exactly easily distracted. This makes me think that Moth is the best answer for this, but let's see. Let's see what we find. We won't have a better idea of what's in there until we until we actually like make a cycle and then the information updates. But let's see about this, the stag door. The Stegdor, a rigged barrier of blood-streaked blood horn, huge enough for a ship to pass. It was broken long ago, and even now the scars are not quite healed. In a declivity beside the door rests a vast and wounded golden head. Its mouth would be large enough to swallow me, were its jaw not shattered. It is... it is the name. Jurby. It begins to intone its riddle. White door. And we have the stag door's riddle. What are the words that make sacrifice sweet? Answer this riddle to, this riddle to pass the stag door and be counted unknown. Um, so I am... Okay, game mechanics. The riddle, the answer to the riddle is always a six degree um, lore of some sort. In this case, I am willing to bat that is Grail from the wording. Like, where are the words that make sacrifice sweet? Uh, that's probably Grail. Let's check heart. Who could hear this and remain unmoved? The sleep, the dead, the earth and the sky. Okay. I don't think it could be anything else. The Great Mother remembers. Okay. Uh, yeah. So, if we do actually need a level 6 Grail, that is... Uh, what converts into Grail? Is a lantern. Winter. Forge into edge. Heart. Heart converts into grail. This puts me in a very bad position. I could break this down and Wow, that is a shitty, shitty position. So here's the way that lore upgrading works. If you can put two lords of the same level together, you can unite them to a higher level, like I did with the Grail. But you can subvert level of the same lore. Yeah, lore of the same level, sorry. Oh. Yeah, you can subvert lore of the same level. So it's like, if I have this heart and another uh, a level zero level one grail i can put it here and it would subvert it would transform the heart into a grail i don't remember if it up upgrades them uh in one swoop so i think yeah muffin lantern so for instance if i put these two together this will create lantern lore instead of moth. 
So you are subverting this one into the second slot. So if I had a level one, if I have a, a level one Grail, I could subvert this heart into Grail. And I think that this process would create like a level two lantern, but I'm actually not sure on that. The main problem with subverting lore is that when you're doing the challenge, you do the challenge for both cards. So it's like in this instance, the the aspect of Watchmen's Secret of the Lantern is that it requires knowledge. And the aspect of the Barber's Warning for the math lore, math lore is that it requires intuition. So you would have to have a Glimmering, which I happen to have, and an Erudition in hand for the for the merger to be successful. So subverting lore is a... It may be necessary here, I would desperately like to avoid it, but the only way that we can get through the stag door without some shenanigans, apparently, is to use some... either some breaking down on subversion, like I could break this down and subvert it, or we can try to clear a few more expeditions and also try to go more to Moorlands and to Ore Flames to try to get more books. But I'm also forever concerned about money. Let's see. At least money is stable right now. That is... We're still at ambition. 